Hey, it's WAG Wednesday with B93.3, and Stacy is here from the Wisconsin Humane Society, and this is Jim. And we love Jim not only because he's a three-month-old kitty, he's also beautiful, but he also has a human name. I have Ben and Frank, the Golden Retrievers, so I think <laughs> Ben, Frank, and Jim has a nice ring to it. I will immediately text my wife, and then she will immediately say no. But so Jim <laughs> needs... Needs a home, and I love Jim. He's just, uh, he's not really sure what to do right now, yeah. and neither am I. Yeah. But, <laughs> it's, good. Um, it's going great so far. Is Jim ready to be adopted? He is. He uh, He's neutered, vaccinated, microchipped. He is available at our Ozaki campus in Sockville, and like you said, he's three months old. He's about four pounds right now. He has a little motor for a purr, and he just he goes does. and goes. It's so sweet. Um, he likes to be out and explore, and he's very adventurous, um, but he's also a snuggly little guy as well. It's like a furry cell phone that's <laughs> vibrating on my hand right now. <laughs> <laughs> if you've never felt a cat purr, it's adorable. Yes. So, yeah, what does Jim like to eat? Does he just like the cat? What do cats like to eat? I'm not a big cat. Uh, I've never had a cat. I've always wanted a cat. Yeah. Um, what do they eat for they, snacks? They like canned food. Canned food. Um, and what was that commercial you know, back in the 80s? Fancy Feast? Yeah, oh, Fancy oh, Feast. Fancy Feast. Yeah, yeah, super fancy. Um, Yow Mix? No, I don't know. <laughs> cats, um, it's up to the individual owner what their cat likes to eat. I know I always ask you the tough questions. <laughs> now, uh, what about other cats? Can he, be, can he be with other cats? I think he would be fine with other cats. When, um, when you come and adopt from us, you do meet with an adoption counselor, and they're able to help talk you through all of that. So if you have a resident cat and you want to bring Jim in, yeah. um, if you want to adopt Jim with another little kitty, um, you could do that. Um, and they'll teach you how to introduce them and make them comfortable and help acclimate them to their new env environment. That's good. If you have like a Dave or a Paul, <laughs> yes. Jim would fit right in. Exactly. <laughs> or a Peaches or a Snuggles, whatever it may be. But we love Jim. Yes. Look at that face. Look at that. He's he sweet. wants a home. <laughs> yes, I do. I can't help it. I got to do the voice every week. Uh, it's with our friends at Bark and Scratch Outpost. Stacy, thanks for bringing Jim in. And uh, you can find him at the Ozaki campus and, of course, on the website. And you do all the social media, all the stuff. 